Let's talk about this secret project that you've been working on. Mm, I like it. So it's not like we didn't have anything going on. No. We had like three projects going on and all of a sudden he shows me, what's your favorite thing to scroll? Other than the Bible, I like <laughs> to scroll Facebook Marketplace. Gets us in a lot of trouble, gets him in a lot of trouble. <laughs> so he comes across, what did you find? A water slide. It was basically just a tube slide, right? A tube slide, yep. A that tube slide. Must have been taken from a like uh, uh, playground or something like that. And it looked tough. It was like red and blue and brown. Pretty. And three hundred fifty dollars. And he's like, I think we should get it. And I looked at him and I said, Are you nuts? Mm -hmm. We got a lot going on. You seriously want to build a water slide? Yeah, I was excited. I thought it would be cool to have at the cabin. On top of that, you had to like leave the next morning and meet the guy. Yeah, so I got up at 7, met the guy by 8. He says still available and drove about an hour to get there. And yeah. I think he was, he was set on it. So, comes home with Over a here, tube puppies. slide. Come here. Yep, loaded up the four place trailer, went and got 26 feet of uh, tube slide. And like, this will be fun. Now I just got to build uh, some kind of a um, trapeze set to hold it at an angle to go out in the lake. So let the building begin. Tate didn't realize, but he was a part of this project too. This was a father-son project. <sighs> yeah, and he did a good job helping. We just bought a bunch of uh, treated lumber and started piecing it together. And Yep, so we'll show you. Let the building begin. Yeah. What should we do today, Tate? <laughs> we should build a water slide. Let's build a water slide. We got water, we got a slide. Now we just gotta build a structure. That hopefully won't fall down or to the side <laughs> yep. when we go down it so yeah Bear with us watch us it'll be fun okay mm -hmm. so now we gotta put the side together it's kind of customizable we're trying to set if we want that in there or what and then we're gonna lift the whole thing up with the forks on the skid steer kind of right in here and then basically build the base onto it while the whole slides in the air okay so we decided against putting this on there because it was going to be too long we didn't have long enough boards but we got the top put on. Now we're gonna hook it up to the skid steer with some tow straps and lift it up and start building. Okay, we got her lifted up. Now we just need to build a couple crossbars. We don't know where we want it to go though. We are gonna put it over by that dock, kind of off that dock or behind the cabin down a hill into the water. So we need to figure that out. This is one of the potential locations down here. We were thinking about having it here, but then it'd only be knee deep. That hurt your butt. Yeah. That's 16 foot here. It'll be knee deep where you splash in. Let's go put it over at the other spot. So it's either that or right here. You know? Hey. Yeah. You got the slide, everything. Like, I don't want that. Exactly. I think this is where we should do it. This is kind of right here. Right here. Yeah. So, 16 foot out would be. We couldn't get it quite high enough with the normal fork, so we borrowed the neighbor's boom thing. It's got a trail hitch on the end, and we hooked that up, and now we can get it tall enough to the point where we just got to lift it up and build the end.
build a platform doesn't so it doesn't tippy, you know, this way or that way. Yeah. After all of our amazing engineering, we came up with this. We're just making her solid. This so these two pieces are gonna come up underneath here and mount right to the bottom of this, and that'll sit in the water. We still gotta figure out all of this, but yeah, just like that. It's good and sturdy in the water. Yep. And it's not gonna go anywhere or this way. Mm-hmm. Perfect. After much more deliberating, we've decided we're gonna have this 4x4 is the bottom, an 8 foot 4x4, and then we're gonna have two boards on each side kind of going up like this, and then we'll have two more in the middle and build the ladders off that. And bulk it up as much as we can, see if she shouldn't tip over. We hope so. Yep. Little update, we got her pretty much just resting. We could take the bobcat away now. Pretty we got quick. the- Yeah, we should probably do a support though. Yeah, crossbars across here, and then we're gonna do one extra bar for me when I go down because I'm gonna need it. I'll need it. <laughs> yep, otherwise we're getting pretty close. So we got her pretty much done. We got our crossbars built. Everything's ready, now we're working on mobility, trying to get it down to the lake. Get two wheels on it, that'll be, make, be, make it easier. We're just going to put these wheels on it, and we're going to pick up the back with the bobcat and just drive it down there just like a trailer. Right, Kinley? Here she goes. So, paddleboard's got to get out of the way. Here it comes. Let's go like this. 
Just lift your end so I don't have to lift the whole thing. Tate's just getting tossed around. There we go. Ruby, we found a duck. Wow, that was fast. How are we going to get up there? Uh, you're just going to climb the poles. Mm-hmm. You have fun with that. Can I go out there, Mom, and see it? Who's gonna go down at first, Dad? Huh? Yeah. You going you going down first? Sure. We got a ladder. Yeah, Look at this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got ladder for you. Awesome. Give me your hand. No, kind of. You go, Dad. Yeah. I am. You want to go first? No. Dad, are you going first? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna get a wet. Okay. I'm gonna get a wet, then go. Okay, here you go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. go. Go face first. Do it. God, it's too scary. Here goes Dad. I build a ladder for it. Have a little bit of an angle so it's not straight up and down, but I think a little platform there to stand and get ready to go down the slide, something like this, all the way across. That's our that's our plan of attack today. Yep. We got it all done. We got our ladder built. And then we got a, a sweet little platform up here so we can stand and go down. And then now, next thing we're gonna get is some lights inside there for at nighttime and a water pump to pump water up at the top. It'll be super sweet. We can't have a water slide without some water. Built ourselves a little pump. Bought a pump. We're gonna build a little tube up there and then make some nozzles to shoot water coming down to the top and on the bottom, see if it works. Okay, we got her all hooked up. We got our hoses ran. You can see we got one hose coming up over the side and going down. We were gonna do kind of spray nozzles and stuff, but we decided we'll do that later. So we got our hose hooked up. I'm gonna plug it in. Give it a try. See if it sucks. Yay! <laughs> Look at that, works perfect. Wow, all it is is a couple pump and a couple fittings. Pretty easy, if we can figure it out, I'm sure anybody can figure it out. So the pump we ended up going with, we just went to Runnings and looked, they had one in stock just on the shelf. It's a 330 gallons per hour, just a tiny little pump, we just plug her in. We got an extension cord, ran from power, right down here. The hardest part was probably finding the fittings, just getting the right fittings. It was super easy because three quarter down to half inch fittings for the hose. Otherwise she works perfect. We just plug it in. Give it a plug. Yep. 
comes right back up, starts squirting down. Runs right down the tube. Okay, so they get this literal monstrosity together. This thing is, how tall is it? Oh, it's got to be 15 feet tall. See, I mean, I don't know if you understand that. It's like okay. almost as tall as a two-story house. It's huge, and it's sitting in our yard, and every neighbor is commenting. It's ginormous, and it is Timber, no. ugly. It's I like it. I think it's cool. <laughs> it's ugly. It's six flags. You it's like it. an amusement park. And I'm like, they finished it in like two days, right? And he had to do the um, trial run, make sure no one would fall out. Yeah, make, make sure it didn't tip over yep. in the wind and in the lake and yeah. So we put it in the water, <laughs> did the trial run, and then I'm like, all right, my turn. Yeah. You guys did this in two days. It's going to take me a little bit longer, but I need to make it pretty. He's real good at coming up with the ideas. And I make him pretty. <laughs> yeah. Usually I come up with the ideas. This one was his baby from the get-go. So Anything for the kids. <laughs> Time to make it beautiful. Smiles. Hey mom, what are you doing? Definitely did not think I was gonna leave this sucker blue and red and brown, did you? <laughs> no. We need to... Dad has good ideas, and then I make them pretty. Pull the slide out for me. That'll be a little easier to paint. A little easier. Got the primer on. Gonna go with the final paint. Make her more alley. And this will be much better. What are you doing? Trying to make it cuter. Yet. No, Ruby, not yet. But boy, this is proving to be a bit challenging. <laughs> Pick out a brand that you want to just come up here and hold it for me. Oh, we're getting close. Too many bugs. <laughs> I think I might need to. This is very, you got to think backwards. That's the knife. Too hard for me. This makes me happy. So much prettier going in this time around. So I thought he was nuts. You were scrolling again the other day. Yeah. And what did you find? Well, when you're talking about water slides, what pops up they, on your phone? More water slides. Siri knows. Yeah. And all of a sudden, there so, was a Walmart one that uh, came yeah. up for like 3000 so or $4,000. And it was nothing pretty. It was just the angled one that slopes down. It's like, hmm. And I thought, wow, babe, you did pretty good because he ended up finagling the slide down to 300 because there's a few broken pieces. Yep. And then we spent $100 on the pump because we have to have it be a water Gotta slide. water in there. I mean, it works without it. Once the kids start going down, it gets wet, but you got to have slip and slide, water slide. And then about $100 in treated lumber. Yep. And then about $50 in paint and $20 in LED lights for the party. So we're under, we're in this thing for under $600.
which now I'm realizing is a screaming deal when we see water slides for $3,300 that are them? not personalized and are not branded and do not look nearly as cute. <laughs> So now, I mean, I don't know. People are just showing up left and right, coming to like the Lundin water park. Just who's that kid out there? It's I don't know who they are. The There's lake. just yep. kids on the water slide, the slip and slide. Just we're gonna start charging. Welcome, friends. Welcome, <laughs> one and all, to Ryan's water park. Yeah. I do want to get flags yet. I couldn't find them on Amazon that came soon enough, but it's happening. I know. Stay tuned for the flags. What else can we get? Like a floating water slide? I'm just crossing my fingers. The paint holds up. All right. Yeah. What's your next project you're going to find on Marketplace? Know. I don't know. It's dangerous because as soon as I go on there, it's like, ooh, I like that. <laughs> but maybe I should delete that app for a while. need to start speaking things over his phone like more beans in the mudroom. <laughs> in the what? In the mudroom. In the mudroom. I gotta think no, about no. I gotta think it's about... not fun. That's not fun. Maybe for you. That's but... true. Who's the biggest child in our family? That's right. That's right. You, you gotta, know what? It benefited us all. It is so fun. The kids absolutely love it. It was a very inexpensive addition to the cabin. We're hoping to have it at the rental property, actually, so you guys can all enjoy it, yeah. too, someday. Yeah. Um, but we're going to use it at our cabin until then. So and We could use it this winter, too, in the snow. <laughs> could put it on the roof. Just pew! <laughs>